Today, Bucks fans are headed out in droves to local retailers, of course, to get their hands on some championship apparel. NBC 26's Eric Crest caught up with fans today to see what they were able to score. At Shields and Grand Chute, Bucks fever has absolutely set in. And while it took a couple of years to build to this point, management doesn't seem to be complaining. The signing of Giannis this summer was huge. That's when things really got cooking. Just this morning, a fresh batch of new apparel arrived, and Bucks fans eager to represent their newly appointed champs are showing up in droves. Trying to buy some uh, things for my uh, daughter and friends after this great victory. I'm guessing it's going to be a little hard because everybody's going to have the fever kind of like I do, but I'll find something. Today I picked up the earned shirt, earned jersey, because, I mean, we did it without a super team. We earned this one. <laughs> These fans aren't terribly picky about what Bucks gear they take home. Most are just ready to represent after so many thought it wasn't possible. I liked it because it's kind of the underdog. Milwaukee's not a big city. We're not Los Angeles. We're not New York. We're little old Milwaukee. Stephen A called it a terrible town. Not so terrible now, is it? From hats to champion t-shirts to onesies, people are breaking out their bucks for the bucks. And they will be eagerly awaiting for the newest apparel to hit the shelves in the days ahead. They said that they want to have hats today, but I mean, I might pick up a new hat too. Yeah, this is the uh, championship hat. It's a nice looking hat. I like it. I mean, you can never go wrong with a championship hat. So if you weren't fortunate enough to visit the Deer District Tuesday night and score some of the exclusive swag, just remember patience is a virtue that Bucks fans know all too much about. It's a great feeling, 50 years in the making. Um, it's awesome for the Bucks and the organization and for the fans. A lot of fans have been waiting a long time for this. In Grand Chute, Eric Crest, NBC 26.